top 20 attractions in London. Have you ever wondered if London's top attractions are still charming? We are going to explore three main places, which are the City of London, the South Bank and the Westminster. Prepare for a thrilling adventure through the bustling streets and hidden gems of this vibrant city. Buckle up, because what you're about to uncover may blow your mind. Let's go! Start our journey at the City of London, is the historic and financial heart of London. Despite being just one square mile in size, it's packed with fascinating sights and attractions. St. Paul's Cathedral is one of London's most famous monuments, with a majestic dome and stunning architecture. Located in the heart of the city, it has long been a symbol of tenacity and endurance. Designed by renowned architect Sir Christopher Wren in the late 17th century, after its predecessor was destroyed in the Great Fire of London. St. Paul's Cathedral is culturally and historically significant, in addition to its architectural magnificence. It has witnessed a number of historic events, including the wedding of Prince Charles and Lady Diana Spencer. Today, St. Paul's remains a place of prayer, a site of national celebrations, and a must-see attraction, providing a peek into Britain's rich past and continuing spirit. Tower of London. Explore this UNESCO World Heritage Site, nestled along the banks of the River Thames, built by William the Conqueror in the 11th century as a symbol of Norman dominance. This iconic fortress has served many roles throughout its nearly thousand-year existence, as a mighty fortress, royal palace and infamous prison. It houses the brilliant crown jewels, a collection of valuable stones and regalia used in coronations and royal events for centuries. Tower Bridge, built between 1886 and 1894, was a masterpiece of Victorian engineering, combining usefulness with architectural grandeur. This spectacular bridge consists of two stunning towers united by a central span that can be raised to allow large ships to pass. Today, it is an important transportation link for both pedestrians and automobiles, as well as a beloved emblem of London's legacy and creativity. The Monument to the Great Fire of London is a towering monument in the City of London. Standing 61 metres tall, it recalls the disastrous Great Fire of London in 1666, which destroyed most of the city's old architecture. Sir Christopher Wren and Robert Hooke designed the monument, which is made out of a Doric column capped with a glowing golden orb that represents the destructive power of fire. Visitors can ascend the 311 spiral stairs to the summit of the monument, where they will be rewarded with panoramic views of the town. Leadenhall Market is one of London's oldest meat, poultry, and game markets, dating back to the 14th century, and is well known for its stunning Victorian architecture. It has evolved throughout the years into a bustling retail centre with a diverse range of stores, cafes, bars, and restaurants. Its magnificent iron and glass roof, combined with cobblestone streets and architectural elements, creates a gorgeous atmosphere that transports tourists back in time. It's also famous for its role in the Harry Potter films. The South Bank of the River Thames is one of London's cultural hubs, offering a plethora of attractions, entertainment venues, and scenic spots. The London Eye, take a ride on the iconic London Eye for unparalleled views of the city skyline. It's especially magical at sunset or after dark when the city lights up. Shakespeare's Globe is a historic theatre in London dedicated to the works of William Shakespeare, the great playwright. The Globe Theatre, built in 1599, was the initial venue for many of Shakespeare's plays, including Romeo and Juliet, Hamlet, and Macbeth. Tate Modern is one of the world's best-known modern art museums. The museum, housed in a former power plant, has an extraordinary collection of modern and contemporary art from all around the world. Admission is free. Tate Modern showcases artworks from the 1900s to the present day, including works by famous artists such as Pablo Picasso, Salvador Dali, Andy Warhol, and Damien Hirst. The Millennium Bridge, commonly known as the Wobbly Bridge, is a new pedestrian suspension bridge that crosses the River Thames in London. The bridge, designed by architects Norman Foster and Anthony Caro, was opened to the public in June 2000 to commemorate the Millennium Milestone. The Millennium Bridge links the Tate Modern and Shakespeare's Globe on the south bank of the Thames to St. Paul's Cathedral on the north bank. The Shard is a famous skyscraper in the heart of London. 
It is the highest building in the United Kingdom and the European Union, with a height of 310 meters. The Shard, completed in 2012, has swiftly become a prominent element of London's skyline, thanks to its distinctive pyramid-like design and glittering glass facade. The structure has 87 floors, featuring offices, restaurants, luxury residences, a five-star hotel, and an observation deck. The Shard's observation deck, known as the View from the Shard, is positioned on the building's 72nd floor and offers guests exceptional 360-degree views of London's landmarks. Borough Market is one of London's oldest and most well-known food markets, located in the historic Southwark neighborhood near London Bridge. In the 12th century, it has a long history as a trading center and gathering place for merchants, artisans, and customers. Now a thriving culinary destination, with a diverse selection of artisanal foods, gourmet pleasures, and exotic cuisines. Queen's Walk is a lovely promenade on London's south bank of the River Thames. It stretches from Lambeth Bridge in the west to Tower Bridge in the east, providing breathtaking views of some of the city's most recognizable monuments, such as the London Eye, the Shard, and St. Paul's Cathedral. Greenwich Park is a lovely royal park in Greenwich, London, known for its lush flora, picturesque views, and historical significance. It was established in the 15th century as a deer park and now comprises 183 acres with a mix of groomed gardens, historic trees, and open spaces. One of Greenwich Park's most prominent features is the Prime Meridian Line, which divides the Earth's eastern and western hemispheres. Visitors can stand on the Prime Meridian at the Royal Observatory Greenwich, which was founded in 1675, and straddle the line with one foot in each hemisphere for an unforgettable photo opportunity. Westminster, steeped in history and brimming with iconic landmarks, is a must-visit destination in London. Big Ben and the Elizabeth Tower are iconic emblems of London. The Tower is one of London's and England's most visible and iconic symbols. The Elizabeth Tower, previously known as the Clock Tower, was renamed in 2012 to commemorate Queen Elizabeth II's Diamond Jubilee. The 96-meter-tall tower contains Westminster's Great Clock, also known as Big Ben. It has the world's largest four-faced chiming clock and the third tallest freestanding clock tower. Each dial is 7 meters in diameter. The minute hands are 4.2 meters long, and the numbers are 60 centimeters long. When Parliament is in session, a distinctive light above the clock face illuminates. The Palace of Westminster is not simply a symbol of British democracy. It is also a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It was originally erected as a royal home in the 11th century, has evolved over time to become the focal point of British democracy. Houses the United Kingdom's two chambers of parliament, the House of Commons and the House of Lords. This historic edifice is known for its spectacular Gothic design, complex detailing, and distinctive clock tower, which houses Big Ben. Westminster Abbey is one of the most historically significant and renowned religious structures. This magnificent Gothic monastery, founded in the 10th century, has played an important part in the nation's religious and cultural life for over a millennium. Its soaring architecture, numerous stained glass windows, and opulent interior make it a UNESCO World Heritage Site as well as a medieval masterpiece. St. James's Park is a picturesque royal park in the heart of London, near Buckingham Palace and Downing Street. It is one of the city's oldest and most popular parks, famed for its lush vegetation, tranquil lake, and breathtaking vistas of iconic monuments. Swans, ducks, and pelicans are among the bird species that call this location home. Visitors can enjoy watching wildlife, feeding birds, or simply taking in the tranquil ambience along the water's edge. Buckingham Palace, the British monarch's official residence in London, embodies the monarchy's grandeur and traditions. Originally constructed as a private townhouse in the 18th century, it grew into a beautiful neoclassical palace with lavish staterooms and notable features such as the balcony. Buckingham Palace now serves as the focal point for national celebrations and ceremonies, including state events and royal banquets. The changing of the guard event, a historic rite in which the Queen's Guard changes shifts, is held outside the palace.
Trafalgar Square is one of the city's busiest public places. The plaza, named after the British naval victory at the Battle of Trafalgar in 1805, is flanked by historic landmarks such as the National Gallery, St. Martin in the Fields Church, and Canada House. At the center is the towering Nelson's Column, topped by a statue of Admiral Horatio Nelson and overlooking the square's busy activities. Trafalgar Square is a hub for cultural events, political demonstrations, and public gatherings, and it represents democracy and free expression. Whether admiring the architecture, feeding the pigeons, or attending a festival or concert, Trafalgar Square has something for everyone to enjoy amidst the rush and bustle of central London. Oxford Street, located in the heart of London's West End, is known as Europe's busiest shopping district. It features a broad assortment of shops, boutiques, and department stores to suit every taste and budget. Oxford Street has a wide range of fashion, beauty, electronics, and homeware stores. From big merchants' flagship stores like Primark and Topshop to well-known department stores like Selfridges and John Lewis. Its bustling walkways are lined with shoppers, visitors, and street performers, resulting in a lively and colorful ambience. With its unequaled shopping opportunities, it is a must-see destination for both London residents and visitors eager to indulge in retail therapy. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more travel guides and tips. Until next time, happy travels!